Akron at Buffalo. It's a noon Eastern time kick on Friday. Weird time, but it's a makeup game. And yeah, I will tell you, uh, I am a I am a fan of them actually playing this game. Buffalo needs it in order to get to a bowl game. This is a big, big spot. Let's go on and pull it up on the screen here so that you can see what we're looking at. Over the last, five, all of these stats, by the way, are over the last five weeks. If we're going to break this thing down, Let's go on and start with Akron's defense, which has actually been really, really good over the past five weeks. They are number five in the country in PPA uh, defense per drive. So, I I mean, their defense has been really, really good. And Buffalo has just completely fallen apart. They had a chance the last three weeks to get bowl eligible and lost all three times. They had an opportunity and didn't take advantage of it. And a lot of it is because of their offense, but the majority is because of their defense. Their offense is number 99 in PPA per pass. Akron is number 42 in that metric on defense. Uh, Buffalo is number 90 in PPA per rush. And Akron is number one in PPA per rush over the last five weeks. And team Teams are actually running on Akron a lot. 55% of the time, Akron is having to defend the run, and it'll be no different here. Buffalo is running the ball over 51% of the time, uh, so not throwing the ball a whole lot. Don't trust the quarterbacks a whole lot. You look at this Akron defense, they're only giving up 2.5 scoring opportunities per game. That is... Um, that is uh, number four in the country, but it's only 2.5 trips inside their 40-yard line, which is kind of crazy to think about. Uh, points per scoring opportunity, Akron is number seven. And when you look at what Buffalo is doing, they're just not being able to finish drives at all. Uh, they are, uh, let's see, number 79 in points per scoring opportunity, uh, number 96 in scoring opportunities per game. So this uh, this certainly set, uh, sets up well for Akron on that side of the ball. As far as offense is concerned, yeah, this is, this is what we're looking at. Okay, um, Akron number 33, PPA per pass. Well, Buffalo's defense is number 27. Akron number 108 in PPA per rush. Well, Buffalo's number 122. So Buffalo defends well what it is that Akron does. Uh, the issue is that Akron, as far as success rate goes, yeah, they may not score a whole lot when they're passing the ball, uh, which certainly would hurt your PPA. That's predicted points added. But you look at what they're doing as far as a passing success rate is concerned. Uh, they are number seven in the country. 44.44% of their passes are successful, uh, which means either getting first downs, uh, et cetera, right? There's getting more, how about this? Getting uh, 50% on first down, 70% of the needed yards for a first down on second. Uh, third down it is either converting or fourth down converting. It, they're they're really good throwing the football, and that's because they've got a new quarterback in there, and the new quarterback is pretty good. Uh, Buffalo, you know, number 23 in penalties per game compared to Akron, number 98. That's certainly something to pay attention to, along with turnover margin. Uh, look, Akron is number 126 in giveaways per game on the season. Uh, they are, excuse me, Buffalo is number five in takeaways per game. So that is something to pay attention to. Although, I, the majority of those turnovers were done when DJ Irons was the quarterback, and Jeff Undercuffler looks like he does not turn the ball over as much. Uh, this team has developed really, really well under Joe Moorhead. Uh, the number says Buffalo minus one, or roundabout. Yeah, that sounds about right to me. Um, I know that this is a double-digit spread, but uh, but give me give me Akron plus the 11 here. Uh, Buffalo is favored by 11, total is 55. I, I might would go the under, and I would probably, yeah, I take that back. I, I might would lean the over on this, but, um, but give me Akron plus the 11. I like the zips. I like Joe Moorhead. I like what they're doing. Thanks for listening to Winning Cures Everything. Make sure and subscribe on YouTube or your favorite podcast app. And make sure to leave a nice five-star review. You can follow Gary on Twitter, at GaryWCE. And the show is at Winning Cures. Be sure to check out the merch in our web store and share the show.